Alexander in the middle of the Manchester City Centre. Um, we now have chickens and we've got um, two beehives. And friends are there for here today because we're planting a bee meadow so that the bees have food uh, throughout the summer. Chickens have been uh, fitted to the bread much roof so that all the eggs uh, are gathered off the chickens but they almost be up as do the vegetables from the vegetable patches as well. Uh, we aim to put a little bit back into Manchester through the bread much. Friends of the Earth, basically over two years ago, we decided that we would try and put some vegetables and an allotment on the roof. Um, that proved to be very successful, and as a result, there was an awareness campaign on the back of that, which Friends of the Earth then contacted us, as they were quite amazed that we'd managed to get as far as we had with this particular project. This year we're going to have some pumpkins, potatoes, onions, carrots, spinach. Um, last year the vegetables were harvested and made into soup for Forever Manchester and it also went down to a sleepover at the Booth uh, Charity, uh, the Booth Centre and all proceeds went to help the homeless in Manchester. So this year we're planting more vegetables that will go into soups. National Friends of the Earth launched their Bee Cause campaign two years ago, so we're now in the third year um, of promoting it. It's basically just creating awareness um, in the public that you know there is a decline in the bee population and how that will affect us. Um, you know, one in every three to four bites of food has been pollinated by a bee, and they estimate that if we lose bees, it's going to cost the taxpayer 1.8 billion a year to artificially pollinate. So we really need them around. So projects like this, living roofs and um, green areas within cities are just going to have such a massive impact on them. Many different environmental projects throughout the city centre, and you know, Friends of the Earth like to work with as many as possible. And um, so, throughout the city centre, there's lots being done to create, you know, wildlife areas. And um, the campaign that the Friends of the Earth run is a national one as well. And already, we've got two uh, bee meadows in the city centre, and we're going to create one soon.